What's up guys, this is Zayar and I hope you are all doing well. 2016 launched so many budget flagship devices and some with Redmi 3S and 3S Prime one of them. Redmi 3S and 3S Prime running on 3.4.1 Marshmallow. Maybe not yet, no guide update in future. So here come XG team for making custom lineage OS 14.1. In this video, I will show you how to install Nougat ROM on Redmi 3S and 3S Prime devices. So, without wasting any more time, let's start it. For that, you need unlock bootloader with successfully installed custom recovery. Then, you need lineage OS 14.1 ROM and Google GFS file. All download links are available in the video section below. After downloading those files, transfer via USB in your device internal storage. Once that is done, switch off your device and boot your device into TWRP recovery by pressing and holding volume up and power key for few seconds until you see MI logo. After successfully booting your device TWRP recovery, then go to backup and select all option and back up your current ROM because if anything goes wrong after what you can simply restore this backup you will back your earlier ROM which you had used in this process it take to 10 to 15 minutes so sit back and relax after that's done go to wipe and swipe to factory reset Now your device ready for installing new ROM. For that, go to install and select Lineage OS 14.1 from your device internal storage and swipe to confirm flash. Once it's done, do same thing with Google GFS file. Once successfully flash all files, then reboot your device and fast boot take few minutes so relax for that. Once booting done, set up your device as your wish and you can see your Redmi 3S or 3S Prime, whichever device you use running on Android Nougat 7.1.1. That's it in this short video. If you like this video, hit this video with thumbs up and if you not like, hit thumbs down. For more video like this, hit that subscribe button and don't forget to enable bell icon. Thanks for watching and I hope to see my next video. Have a good day.